Full Metal Alchemist what up, what Brotherhood. Up? Oh, it's so good. We're I'll live. That. Yeah, it's hey, good. what's We're going on, guys? Yeah. Uh, we caught yeah, Ryan in the middle of eating some gummy bears, it looks like. Uh, gummy bears. Yeah, yeah. So, welcome to TMC, Tabletop Magic Commander, guys. Uh, I'm Steve. We got Ryan. Uh, this over here next to me right there. We got Brandon down here. We got Nick over here in the corner. So, play some Might commander tonight. Uh, real quick, if, you, if you're watching this on YouTube, look in the co in the description of the video. There'll be a, um, a time start from... Whenever we finally get our webcams facing the board, we're playing Magic and rolling with that. Oh. Also, tonight's episode is titled The Lowest Pro Production Quality Possible for EDH. I do not have animations for our when we play our commanders, which is something we typically do. Uh, so what I'm going to do is uh, apologize for that. And then also, on oh, YouTube, the, uh, YouTube upload, once our animation sequence rolls out, I'm going to have a montage of our commander sequences back-to-back -back so you guys can check out our awesome normal high production quality so <laughs> what's up Lotto? uh also big news tonight's episode is sponsored by kaiba corp <laughs> so i was gonna say angry orchard coming from really? the guy no, that doesn't angry even orchard, but actually kaiba corp <laughs> so uh be on the lookout for a special kaiba corp Still sponsored wet. TMC Yu-Gi-Oh! Magic crossover event happening sometime in the near future. Once again, sponsored by the one and only Kaiba Corp. This is news to me. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> if you know, that. you know. Okay, My if you know, you know. This, I'm game. Yo, we My need to make our Yu-Gi-Oh! We have a Yu-Gi-Oh! channel in our Discord. Um, we, is, is that set just for us, or can anyone access that? The Yu-Gi-Oh one is this to us. We should this make that public, dude, because we might have oh, some boy. closet Yu-Gi-Oh fans in our Discord we don't even know about, you know. You make it public whenever we go live with the Yu-Gi-Oh decks. Okay. I'll okay. do that. Yeah, we'll have an event for it. It'll be a release date for our Yu-Gi-Oh channel. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. I said he's busy that day. <laughs> yeah, me too, dude. Uh, but no, we pretty much made some, uh, some Yu-Gi-Oh themed magic decks. Uh, we're going to be rolling those out probably... I don't know. Ryan's been working on his for weeks, and it looks like there's no end in sight. So honestly, I can't tell you. <laughs> well, uh, you see what had happened was they keep making cool art frames for cards, and I have to wait for my developer to develop those. Developers, developers, <laughs> so, <heck> developers. <laughs> yep. Uh, so, oh, next week I think we're planning on playing PDH. If I, if it I'm is the screw the rules commander game, Mister oh, Cool. Mister Mister Cool knows what we're putting down. <laughs> yeah. yeah. As long as so. everything uh, with Card Kingdom goes as planned and I can get my deck in time, then yes. Right, right. For sure as these guys. Uh, well, thank you for joining us tonight. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this episode of Commander. I hope we enjoy it too because, I mean, we're playing it. So, uh, tonight... Assault, uh, there's a countdown. Somebody, somebody start a stopwatch now and see how long into this it takes before someone gets salty. Yes, that's freaking genius. Let me start it. All right, I started it right now. All right, so I'm playing Marin tonight. Uh, four drop. Two, Are you still yet? Two uh, I'm, guessing, I'm, guessing, <laughs> I'm guessing seven and a half minutes. In. All right, go ahead and stop the stopwatch. We're already salty. Uh, <laughs> seven and a half minutes. That's that's only like halfway through my thirteen first seconds. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, Marin, it's it's Marin creature deck stuff. I've got the secret layer version here. Um, I you guys, the I mean. It's Marin. Marin's Marin. Marin's going to do Marin stuff. You know what to expect. Ryan, what are you playing tonight? Tonight I am playing Brea. Uh, I chose Brea just so I could run these specific colors. Other than that, she ended up having some pretty strong synergy with the deck. But overall, name of the deck's uh, Pay to Win, right? So all I care about is generating treasures, uh, doing a lot of artifact shenanigans with treasures. So. Okay, just playing Brea. I should have played. My also, other... <laughs> if you want to see more footage of the deck, it's two ninety nine for each uh, episode. <laughs> <laughs> Got to you know oh, pay to win. Two ninety nine Kaiba dollars. Yeah, like, um, these are cards. Something. They don't have the colors that are in my I deck. Will, at least. Okay, uh, I thought um, you were playing Ragdos, Nick. <laughs> I am. That's why these cards aren't in my deck. They're just cards that are on my desk. So. Oh, okay. Um, okay. Yeah, that's confusing. Uh, can I start with them out though? That would be great. <laughs> I Probably just tap not. to activate this instant. No, okay. If you let us win um, the first game, yeah, maybe. But it might be if worth it to draw three cards every turn. If you can <laughs> see on turn two, then yes. 
Um, but yeah, I'm playing Lact- Lactose Lord of Riots, and I'm going to make all of our viewers a promise. And that promise is this will be the worst Rakdos Lord of Rise deck you've ever seen. Oh, wow. Um, That's a heavy promise. <laughs> That's the kind of promise. Based on my previous experience of playing this exact list and not editing it, it is not good. Um, Bro. I'm just going to let you know I'm at 8,000 cool. channel points, so. <laughs> <laughs> you might need to put me out of my misery if I don't get past three lanes. You need 10,000 to one-shot somebody, right? But, yeah. Um, yeah. He's, close. Close. He's close. I'm getting close. <laughs> Maybe Brandon, next week. Brandon, what are you playing tonight, bro? Oh, me? Uh, I, well, I'm in the forest here. I'm going to be playing Rise, uh, the Redeemed here. Uh, oh, one man. mana, one one. Mainly, if you know anything about me, you know that I do not draw lands at all. <laughs> so I want to play a commander that I could always play. So Rise costs one mana. Uh, he creates tokens, and then he doubles tokens. Uh, um, and that's what he does. Yeah. Oops. Selesnia, that's good, man. Selesnia token deck. Yeah, that, that's a, everyone knows what it does. Uh, we got a pretty interesting matchup. Um, I don't know. I I feel like we're kind of all on a similar level. I've seen Ryan's Brea deck what? do some pretty good stuff, some pretty strong stuff. Um, no, so. it's just the power of how broken treasures are. Treasures. <laughs> Steven, yes. what treasures. what combination of my deck is straight up garbage and Ryan playing Brea? Is the same parallel. <laughs> well, it doesn't even matter where his other ninety nine cards are. Well, I'm not running any like infinite combos tonight, so it's like, um, you know, it's a little bit aristocraty, but not really. Like, I think I got maybe Zulaport Cutthroat, and I don't even know if Blood Artist made the cut still. But so I'm just gonna be swinging with creatures, man, and killing them and bringing them back. Mister Cool's gonna love it. Oh uh, yeah, so I, I will say. I, about the I will say deck. that my my deck is dated. It is almost a year old and it has not been updated since i initially built it so it's missing like the last four sets where they printed oh, like there's some really really, really good card. treasure cards yeah. i think the last Dark card Side? i put in here was gold gold span dragon i was gonna say do you have gold span dragon because that's yeah. like it's like the best treasure card or zorn zorn's yeah, really good it. yeah i don't have zorn in here oh i, I have a real copy see i have a real copy on the desk right here but uh it's not in here <laughs> <laughs> it, well, Dockside, that's in there, isn't it? Dockside's in here, yeah. Yeah, I've seen your mind. Well, all right, guys, uh, that's our intro um, for our decks we're playing tonight. Um, I did miss an announcement for uh, if you, if once we reach 100 Discord members, I don't have the graphic to pull up right now, but uh, once we reach 100 Discord members, we are giving away an AFR set booster box. Um, yep. If you're, one of, our, right. if you're one of our first 100 members, um, then you will uh, be entered to get that. So, uh, and if you invite someone into the Discord, just message at Arbor in the Discord, and we'll get you entered twice into the prize pool. So, we're looking to hit that goal sometime uh, in the next uh, three years. So, uh, <laughs> just keep an we're eye out. That. They'll they'll be coming we're out with AFR two by the time we're giving away this we're AFR. About a member a month at this point. So, they'll Make be on AFR, AFR, AFR two. The AFR work. two might come out in February for all you know. It's possible. <laughs> it's, it's that's that's yeah. about ten. That's about ten sets away. Sounds about right. <laughs> right yeah, that's yeah. great. All right, y'all ready to roll? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, let's play some magic, guys. We'll be right back.
and we're back. <laughs> welcome, welcome, everybody. We're going to we get go. some dice rolling going. I think Nick's already rolled. Didn't you say you already rolled, Nick? He rolled a D6. All right, can I keep my D6 rolled? Because I just rolled a 4 on a D20. <laughs> <laughs> he rolled a... I rolled a six. Did you roll a six or a four? <laughs> I rolled a six on a D six. A six count? on a D six. I was gonna roll a D twenty, uh, a random D twenty, if that's cool. Um, yeah, that's what we normally do. Do that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I also rolled a six. Oh. <laughs> oh, I got a five, dude. Oh. Why are you guys rolling so low? I rolled a four on my D twenty. All right, Nick. <laughs> me and you gotta roll off. All right. Brand, okay, Brandon's <laughs> clearly going first. He got a 16. Uh, so it looks well, like... Well, me and Ryan got... rolling off, that means I need to roll my D6. Because <laughs> that's what I rolled a 6 You got on. Brandon first. <laughs> Ryan, you got a 6. I got a 5 and Nick got one, a 4. Ryan. Is that right? Beat it, Ryan. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> Super oh, low rolls over here tonight. So, all right, let me get some of that their music playing. And, Wait, uh, sir, I'm going to go second. Uh, uh, Steven, you can go third because I rolled a 4 and I did 20. I don't know. Oh, yes, I, I'm going third, sir. Yeah, I'll go last. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, I think, I think I'm think i ready. I, I got to resolve Molo real quick, but... Right. Playmat's dirty. Need a new playmat for Christmas. Hopefully, hopefully I was a good boy this year. Santa brings me a nice playmat. We'll see, dude. We'll see. Oh, this music is super epic. Jeez. Is it good? It's just—it's really intense for like no lands on the board. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, I don't know if I can keep seeing it. I don't. Uh, uh, I don't. Uh, I'll try. I can't get his hand. I'm gonna have to mull it. Free molly I'll number try. one. Oh, he already did. Okay. Uh. I like two swap and a bunch of green spells. That's not good. Well, uh, I took one molly. I'm gonna I'm hold on. Now. Yeah, hold on. Right. Cut it a few times. And... Mr. Cool, we could do like you know uh, Uno cards. We could do like skip turn and and reverse. <laughs> yeah, bro, there is a skip turn card already. Uh, it's called Glorious yeah, End. A... No, I meant like. For the channel points. Oh, okay. I, I'm just saying, Glorious Sand is legit. Like skip you. I mean, you lose at the end of it, but. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I think I think I can keep this hand. I'm I'm gonna try to keep this hand, so I'm good to go when you guys are. All right, everybody, good. Yes. Yes. Yeah. To. All right. Here we go. Turn I... one. I'll start the salt meter. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, I'm gonna play a Celestia Guildgate. Comes in tapped, and then I will pass my turn. Why is there a timer? <laughs> Wild card draw four. Wild card is just like a regular common blue spell. <laughs> are we timing? Are we timing Ryan's turns now? Okay. I'm no, back. this is the salt timer. This is it until somebody gets salty. This is okay. Yeah. Uh, I see the Sonod and the Soul Ring into the Zorius signal. Oh my! That did stop the timer. Stop, 27 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> 27 seconds in. <laughs> Alright, draw for turn. I'm gonna drop out an undergrowth stadium. Uh, it's, it comes in untapped because I have two or more opponents. Do I have any turn one plays? Uh, pass turn. Pass turn. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, that's a good idea, Lotto. Skip a player's turn, but they draw four says it's a wall. I need to, dude, need to adjust my freaking video settings. Hold on. I want to play a Badlands and a Soaring and then pass to Oh boy. He's halfway there. It's a little too dark. Ooh. All right. Well, I wish I had crazy plays like that. I will <laughs> untap and draw. They both got a Soaring, uh, Brandon. That sucks, man. Yeah, hey, one of us is Brea and one of us is a deck that whenever casts Commander with the Soul Ring. <laughs> I'm going to play more. And then I'm going to pay two mana for Lotus Cobra. There, that's a little better to look at now. I'm trying to live up to our title for the stream, which is the lowest production quality possible here. I mean, this deck right. definitely lives up to that. 
<laughs> in every way imaginable. Also, spell table is not working tonight, so there's also that. Untap, draw. Lotus Cobra. Uh, I'll, I'm gonna shock in a blood crypt and lose two life. And I'm going to use the soul ring to tap the signet and then tap for a blue and a black and play a dead eye plunderer. Dead eye plunderers. Five mana two, two, on turn two. Wow. He will be a five nice. five right now. That's a uh, that's a really good popper commander too. Bro, what in the world and is happening right then now? Then I'll pass turn. On your instep, I'm going to tap for a green and cast out a worldly tutor. And That's what I, I have an idea of what I'm going to get. It's nothing too bad here. Four frog. That was, that's actually game. not a bad idea, Ryan. I, I think I'm going to do that. I don't think I'm going to get Spore Frog. Yeah. That's an interesting decision. Well, he did. He does have a 5-5 five five on the board, right? You get a Spore Frog 5 damage. <laughs> yeah, dude. I can bring Spore Frog back. Spore Frog back. It's no problem. So that goes to the top. This goes to the graveyard. Untap. Draw for turn. I know, Lotto. I held back on this deck because, like, I vaguely considered making it real. So I didn't put like the OG duels. I'm just gonna drop a Phyrexian <laughs> Tower, tap my Undergrowth Stadium for Spore Frog and pass turn. Um, I put the OG duel in this deck because I like good lands and also I, I own the bad lands. I told you the bad lands. I remember correctly. My turn. Yep, <laughs> it's yep, my yep. turn. Watch me yep, not yep. cast any spells. Spore Frog is actually Karibo. So you guys know in the, in the Yu-Gi-Oh adaptation decks that we built, that's what it that's what it represents. I'm gonna play the Smoldering Marsh tapped. I am good at magic. Yes, I you know. Um, and I'm gonna pay one, and I'm gonna play Phyrexian Reclamation, and then I'm going to pass turn. Okay. Uh, Rex the synergy Reclamation. over there in Rectos, <laughs> so good. Synergy. Sticks where, oh, where is? <laughs> Phyrexian Reclamation, so yeah. There we go. Alright, Brandon, you go. Um, yeah, I know, but I didn't draw a land, which was like the one thing that I couldn't do. I t like, th this is exactly what I talked about. This is why I just... Think... White chocolate macadamia <laughs> nut. This is why I'm we... Just, I'm guessing. Such is life for Brandon one. here on TMC. Which is why my commander costs one. I'm playing Rise of Redeem. Why don't you just start putting like 45 land on all your decks? I have to. I actually, actually, I do have an animation there for that. There we go. I got, I got like uh, one animation sequence done, and it's just for Rise because I think Brandon played him around Halloween, and we we had him for that. Hi, Brandon. Are you done? Yes. Oh, sorry. I thought it was buttons. Yeah, there you go. Tap. Yeah, roll. Roll. Oh, it's not roll. Alright. My deck's so good, guys. I'll play a snow covered mountain. Uh, la 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 la. I'll play. 88. Four. I'd never draw lands. <laughs> that's so few lands, <laughs> Otto. Jeez. That's because that's because they run like twenty mana rocks and they all cost like zero. Storm the vault. Yeah, Laura, how many mana sources do you have in your deck? Like forty eight? <laughs> that sure. and only twenty of them are lands? Cookie shop, Mr. Cool. Hit hit me up. Come pick me up. <laughs> we'll go. Anyway, I play Storm the Vault. That and then I'm gonna I'm gonna go to combat and I'll swing my dead eye at Nick because he doesn't have a creature. Oh! Because I don't have a creature. I got a sport frog. Are you bro. Insinuating that the other players oh, that block sense. and somehow killing their creatures is less value than killing me? Wow, that CMC's uh, like half. No, no. I had ulterior modus. So I hit you for five? No, I want the worst player dead first! Um, yeah, okay, I'm five. I take five. <laughs> no, my alternative motor, uh, motive, mo not motor, my alternate motor, uh, or I don't have a treasure token, apparently, like, readily available here. Awkward. Here we go. Is to get the treasure token from Storm the Vault, 
So whenever one of my creatures does combat damage to a player, uh, I get to create a treasure. And then, let's see if I have anything else at the moment. I do, <laughs> do not. Donut. Uh, I go to my end step, and then this, if I control five or more, which I only have four, unfortunate, it'll transform. Hey, oh, Wesley. Yeah, <laughs> we probably could have guessed that, though, based on your name. <laughs> What's up, Wes? What's up? <laughs> Upkeep draw. Hey, yo, 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 what's the go? What we got here? Um, <clears throat> drop out of forest. Hey, I wish I had one of them. Day three. Cast out in awakening zone. Pass turn. Power plays, bro. Power plays. Yeah, my deck is is not as competitive as my other decks. It's kind of a middle of the road deck. He just says that because it runs forty creatures. Yes, <laughs> and I don't know what yep. to do with that. You swing them. Yeah. Normally, I run forty like, creatures. Just like you that squirt frog who could have swung and hit me for one because I don't have a buffer. See if he doesn't have to kill you, I turn dude sideways. Oh, bro, squirt frog is a very peaceful creature though. He doesn't want to see people get hurt. That he would didn't have to tap to sack himself. <laughs> Yeah, you can sack him at any point. It's your turn, Nate. You know, I'm gonna play Castle Lockthrain and then I'm gonna pay five and cast a spell. Oh boy. Weird, uh -oh. right? I'll play Liliana Death's Majesty. I'll Mil plus oh my goodness. Uh, yeah. to Mil two and make a zombie. And I have to go get a token. So five drop, five makes a zombie mill two. Oh, gonna get my token. Can bring back creatures from his graveyard only. Hmm. Pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, is it my turn? Alright, let's see. Heart of the cards. Nope, it's not with us. So, um, I guess then I am just going to discard Garrick Primal Hunter and pass my turn. Oh, gosh, dude. How does this happen every uh, week? <laughs> Yo, we, we gotta we gotta do something, man. Brandon's hurting over there. Brandon, three, three. I'm gonna, we're gonna add three lands to all your decks. <laughs> Just add three lands to all your decks. <laughs> yeah. Draw. Run like forty. Bro, and I spent the entire intro shuffling, so it's not like it's not shuffled well. Right. I'll play right. a field of the dead for my land for turn. Oh gosh. Uh, let's see. Are you guys sure this isn't CEDH? It kind of feels like it. <laughs> not over here, it's not. Well, besides Brandon. <laughs> and besides me, I'm playing a little Awakening Zone over here. Nothing too strong. I'll tap for a blue and a red there, and I'm going to run out of Bruda Clad. Bruda. Bruda Clad. That's such a weird name. Telcor Engineer, 4-4 four, four creature tokens you control have haste. <laughs> hey, hey worldly tuner is only mildly yeah. competitive, yeah. Mr. Cool. <laughs> uh, I'll go to combat and I'll get my uh, token here. It's a bloomer. I don't have that one just readily available here. He's a bloomer. And then I'm gonna also not swing at anybody, uh, but the, on the ability, uh, I get to choose a token I control. So I'm gonna have the Mur just become a treasure token. Noise. Noise. He says, I get a free treasure every turn. <clears throat> Is that right? That's what he says. All right. Uh, so that was an additional treasure. So this guy's an 8-8. Eight, eight. Good lord. Uh... All right, yeah, I'm just going to pass turn there, and at my end step, uh, I control five artifacts, so this transforms. Should we be worried? Yeah. yeah we've already I lost. I think Ryan's <laughs> a lot. On tap up, keep trigger. We're going to get a token. I think I actually have the real token here for that, too. Uh, this deck is very prepared for what's happening, so get a Eldrazi spawn token, draw for turn. I will drop out... An equally non-competitive guy's cradle. It's my land drop return. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's 
see how I want to do this. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Yeah, I'll just do it. It doesn't really matter because I can't uh, do anything anyways. I'll tap Guy's Cradle for two green, and then I'll tap this for black, and I will tap this for one more, and I'm just going to play out Marin. Pretend there's an animation sequence here. Don't you have like 60, 60 slides of lore for or something? Just go through those real fast. I do have a look. lot of lore slides <laughs> for Mary. <laughs> I saw that, Brandon. I don't know what you got going on. Over okay, there. <laughs> uh, that, that's that's it, Pastor. I will now go through my lore slides for Mary. <laughs> We'll play this Cavern of Souls, and the creature type will be Demon. Demon? The what? What is that? Jeez. Steven already misplayed. Bottle's already calling him out. <laughs> Hold on. What is my misplay? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nothing. Oh, I could have brought it back right away. I guess you're right. Yeah, I was just thinking I was going to wait. I can sack this guy, too. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm and going it's another to. Another creature, not just non-token, which is cool. I'm just gonna go ahead and minus Lily to reanimate this tectonic giant. I like that guy. Me, me too. Um, and then I'm gonna use Governor Souls in my lands to play Rakos. A, to play Rakos, yeah. Ho ho, Lord of wow. Riots. Six, He's six. a riot, so they say. Like triple. He's big boy. My <laughs> brain is wet and ha. <laughs> Creature spells you caught you cast cost one less to cast reach one life your opponents have lost this turn. Cool. Interesting that, card. That, 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 that pitcher's brain in water in his forest trying to make more of them. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll pass. Damn, I can't do anything. Alright. Well, let's see. Oh my god. Um Well, It's not a land, but hey, what uh, what enchantments are on the board right now? Uh, I have a Phyrexian Reclamation. I let me check my board state. I have one enchantment. It's Awakening Zone. You have Awakening Zone, Nick. What do you have? Phyrexian Reclamation. What does that do? It I can lets him bring mana stuff into back. life to put a creature card from the graveyard to my hand. Yeah. Let's him bring uh, stuff back. Okay. Um. Or yeah, lot. I was just saying, like, uh, she'll still get, she'll still get an experience counter off of the Eldrazi dying, even though it's it's a token. What's the uh, what's the mana cost of both of those things? Mine is one. Stevens is three. Stevens is three. Ryan, you don't have any enchantments or anything, huh? No enchantments. There's lots, lots of artifacts. artifacts. My, I already flipped my enchantment. It's a lane now. Okay, well, sorry, Steven. Uh, <laughs> but I'm not going to discard anything. So I'm going to pay two mana and cast Aura Mutation on the uh, Awakening Zone. We'll play an arch enemy, and this Oof. guy would rather hurt the team than discard a card. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I guess, it, is it get exiled or destroyed? What was that card? Uh, it's destroyed, yeah, it gets destroyed. And then I also get to make three 1-1 uh, one, one saplings. That's also why I did it. That's not nice, bro. Well, yeah, you know, I, 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 I also safe. haven't drawn a land this game. <laughs> These two are in my opening hand. So. Ooh, that's rough, man. So rough. Um... Uh, and then I'll pass my turn. How big is Rectos? Is he a 6-6? Six, six? He's a 6-6, six, six, yes. He's big, dude. Ryan He's has the blue guy's dude. cradle. <laughs> Fault, the backside of Storm Vault. Decisions, decisions here. Alright, yeah, I'll just untap. Okay. 
you were out. Need sound effects. We got that. <laughs> we don't need sound effects. We just have Ryan making weird noises. <laughs> Ryan is the sound effects. <laughs> um. Sure. Why not? Let's uh. Tap so ring for two. Just kidding. Let me think about this. One. Here comes a 15 minute turn. This is five. Six. Uh, Yo, peace, lot of five to tap that. So that's seven mana. I'm going to cast Brass's Bounty. Oh, Lord. For each land I control, I get a treasure. Oh, God. I have five lands. Five treasures. Jeez, bro. So that put me at seven treasures. Sorry if I can't read the treasure. My dice, metal dice don't look that great. Uh, that makes this guy really big. Uh, I gained five, so 13. I will go to combat, which makes a dude here, which I'll turn into a treasure. And then I'll swing 14 at Nick. Oh. <laughs> Does he tremble? Nope. Okay, then my zombie will block him. Heck yeah. Hmm. Should I, should I really make this arch enemy? It's already an arch enemy. What are you talking about? It already <laughs> is arch enemy, right? I don't know if you're. It was arch enemy before feet. you played your first land. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna pay seven with treasures. But then after you played your first land, you played soul ring, so it was arch enemy times two. <laughs> I'm gonna play ruinous ultimatum. <laughs> Destroy all non impermanence your opponents control. That's cute. Well, I've got a response. Okay. Is it to counter it? Are you blue? No, I, I don't. Not? I don't have a counter, unfortunately. Gonna I'm just going to sacrifice my token <laughs> and sacrifice my spore frog. I was going to uh, say because um, I'm ready to scoop. If you guys are, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to give it one more turn, and then I'll tap my Phyrexian Tower and sacrifice Marion Toot as well before it resolves. Brandon, what do you think? Are you ready to scoop? Uh, yeah. I'll scoop. Okay. Brandon, sorry. All right, me and Brandon scoop. <laughs> Good luck, Steven. <laughs> what? You guys are going to leave me alone to fight Ryan by well, myself? Well, he has two lands, and I have I... two lands in my hand, and that's all I have as well. So. My top card's not a land. Two, three. Favorite? It was four more, four more turns until I drew a land. Yeah, no, I'm gone. Yeah, this takes bad. Let me see what I'll top deck. Let me, is it I my was turn? After I got... <laughs> is it my <laughs> turn? Yeah. I'm all right, on top. <laughs> Draw. <laughs> so, Steven, is that timer still running, or did we already pass that? Heard it. Oh, I actually <laughs> is still running. We yeah. Salt 27, minutes, 27 seconds in. Oh, yeah, we, we <laughs> broke the salt thing pretty quick. I'm going to crack my verdict catacombs and go get a dual land here. I'm just going to see if there's anything I can actually do. I'm curious. I'm curious. So, I had to pay a life to crack it, go down to 39. Me too. Overgrown tomb coming in. Shock myself. Go to 37. Uh, pirates, you missed uh, everything that normally happens. I drew no <laughs> lands. Ryan went crazy somehow. Me and Nick scooped. Uh, and now I'm shuffling, waiting for game two. Four. Four. Oracle of Moldiah. Play the top card of my library revealed. Spashion of Remembrance. I can play an extra land. Pass turn. If only I had just a little bit, tap. So I could just zap If I right. survive for one more turn, I think wow. I can pull something off. <laughs> Brandon's oh. sweating over there. <laughs> I'll uh, pay two. We're already ending uh, game one here in like 15 blue, minutes. Blue and a black, I'll play a Belfal Strix. Try card. I'll play an island for turn. These decks are not on the same level. Clearly. Clearly not. <laughs> <laughs> what? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I distinctively said what I'm, I'm going to play about Brave just because I've got a player. guy's cradle on the board and I'm irrelevant. Like, you have <laughs> the blue guy's cradle, the Storm the Vault backside. 
Yeah, you're just your creatures aren't as busted as treasures are, are they? Well, they're especially not <laughs> whenever they all die from a board wipe. Uh, I'll go to combat, which will make a token, and I'll turn it into a treasure. And I need to count this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are we still going? Is Ryan, kill him already. Yeah, I'm I waiting, waiting for him to do it. I both these guys. I got a 9-9 nine, nine and a 4-4 four, four swinging at you. All right, I'll stop block the 9-9 nine, nine and take the 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Down 33. My nice turn. turn. Yep. My turn, all right, untap. Yeah, Braeus, Braeus real strong. Keep draw, draw the Bastion of Remembrance. How many creatures you got in your graveyard, Ryan? Uh, none. I have Boros Ultimatum and Brass, Brass's Bounty. Okay. Just pay four. Man, I haven't even played my commander yet. Pay I'm four really excited. and cast out a Yawgmoth and pass turn. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang in here because if I can get this you're, spell Steven, off. Steven, goo! You're, you're, in, you're in step. <laughs> uh, one, two. Tap this. It's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven blue. So. Rift. And I have to do a red. <laughs> okay, so that covers that. And it's six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I will explosion dog moth for eleven. So you hit him for eleven damage? And I draw eleven cards. Okay. Ooh. And that was it at your instep. Sure. It's your turn. Seven. Eight, I nine, just want him to, I want him to see if he I want to see if he can actually kill me. I don't think he can. Like What do you mean you don't think he can? I don't think he can. <laughs> I don't think he can. No, I don't Bruh. think he can, dude. Bruh. Alright. I don't think he can, said the man with a machine gun pointed at him. I don't think he can kill me. <laughs> he ain't done it yet. Alright, I'll play All right. Great Furnace. Come on, guys, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. No treasures. Six. Seven. This guy's an 8-8. Eight, eight. Bro, I can't mm. believe I wasted my first place game like that. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. You know how hard it is to get to first place? If I don't top deck a land... Oh, I top deck a land, actually, next turn. I don't know what that feels like. <laughs> right. right. I'll pay four. Yeah, put more, dude, put more things out and swing out. And uh, cast right. Pirate's Double Prize. Strike. Double strike. To draw two more cards and make a treasure. Right. Double strike. Double strike. Yeah, you hate to see it. <laughs> That's right, Wesley. Doom, doom, doom. I was just gonna say I've got a bane of progress in my hand, and I'm just waiting until I can cast it. Blows up all of his artifacts. Although I'm pretty sure he drew a counter spell, so I'm just gonna save everyone the time here. And while Ryan takes his, I go to come back. while <laughs> Ryan takes his ten minute turn to decide what he can um... do against my non board state, I'm gonna concede. So. There. Uh, Yay. For 15. Yay. Uh, Yay. There's no targets, no legal targets for the for the damage. Did you draw the land you needed? <laughs> no. Well, Look, I, I, mean, I never even took a point of damage before I conceded. I don't even have to reset. <laughs> I'm ready to go. Oh my gosh, dude. Do we have our own ban list within the group? I ban every card that Steven plays in my mind. Yeah, yeah uh, I, I want to ban every tutor because I don't think Steven can build a deck without one. Dex shouldn't be built without tutors, that's my opinion. <laughs> Alright guys, game two! Hey. Right, I'll, I'll play a different deck, guys. It's my bad. <laughs> no, 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 play the, play the same deck. I just want to play a deck that's... that's like, I got blown out when you blew all my stuff up. I, I was done, so I screwed. Gross. I just gross. want to draw lands. 
Yeah, and Brandon didn't have land, so that was the other reason. I was like, I know I can't beat him one on one, and Brandon's also not in this game. I'm not in this game that got blown up, so it's already one v one for him and Steven. There's no point in me wasting everyone's time. <laughs> and there goes the salt meter. We'll be right back with game two, guys.